Hi, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, thanks for joining me. My name is Karina, and as you can see by my thumbnail and the title of this video, today I have a haul. It's been a while. It's been a while, but not any haul. It's a TJ Maxx and a Marshall haul. I love those stores, so I figured that I would combine my recent purchases and not so recent purchases to show you guys because I personally love watching videos like this and I just want to show you what I got so that you can go get it too because they're good finds. So yeah, I have my Marshall bag. I don't have many things from Marshalls, but I do have TJ Maxx which has more stuff. They make me happy. Now did I need all this stuff? Of course did not did I want all this stuff of course I did and should we treat ourselves of course you should if you can go ahead and treat yourself girl and boy do what makes you happy but anyway before we get started with the video can we take a moment for the bags again I'll give you a close-up tell me that design is not super cute it's donuts and this one it's dogs like, they knew Karina was going into the store and that she was going to buy that because it's two of her favorite things. So, of course I got them. <laughs> and then fun fact about me as I'm sitting here in my office, I have a bunch of other TJ Maxx and Marshall bags. Uh, maybe I should be ashamed of sharing how many I have. Do I need all of those? No, of course I don't. Am I obsessed with their prints? Of course I am. Look. Look at this one. Tell me that's not a cute bag. And it's not like I just have them sitting around not being used. This one actually has some crafts that I'm that I used recently uh, for a project. So I have them in there. I use them to carry my stuff to work. I use them when for Christmas, especially like to carry my gifts when I go to um, my family's homes and my friends' places. So they're being used. But I know I don't need so many, but TJ Maxx and Marshalls knows what they're doing with their designs because they know there's a lot of Karinas out there that are easily gravitated to buying all their bags. Enough talking about bags, okay? This is not what that bit, this video is all about. I know you guys are ready to see what I bought recently and not so recent because like I said, I included some items that I purchased a while ago, but I know you can still find some of them because I've seen them. So if you want to see all the goodies that I got, let's get started. We are going to start off with Marshalls because I don't have so many items in my Marshalls bag. So starting off with this cap. Oh my God, it's dirty. How rude. It's this hat. I've already worn this one this one's i think one of my first purchases for this year from marshall's and i'm obsessed i've been wanting a polo um hat but i just didn't want to splurge on a i think they're like i don't know 70 dollars <laughs> no ma'am not right now and i got it and i believe for this one if i'm not mistaken i paid 14 bucks 14.99 so the color perfect chest kiss I've worn it plenty of times and it's one of my favorites this year so far for sure. So yeah, I'm happy with that purchase for sure. Moving along with the next purchase from Marshalls is a set. It's something that I love buying from Marshalls and TJ Maxx is sets. I highly recommend that you go there for sets because sets are always, I feel like a good purchase because you can wear them in so different ways you can wear obviously together because they're a set you can wear them separately um so you can get a lot of outfits out of, of one purchase so anyways this is the set it kind of looks not so cute because it's obviously all wrinkled i actually washed this one already because it was in the clearance section and the pants are long so i they were like um like hitting the floor so they got really dirty i always try to wash my clothes before i wear it so um i already washed this one but i just realized that i left the plastic thing in there when i washed it but i like the material because it's really like thick it's kind of see-through but i'll wear it with some like nude um shorts and i love the color like the olive color and this are the pants and then the shirt it's a little like crop for my taste you know but we'll make it work it's like this you can't really see that like the cut can you you see so it's supposed to be flattering um like i mentioned it's a little 
too cropped for my taste mind you the shirt that i'm wearing is very cropped but i'm wearing i'm just wearing it for this video right now so <laughs> this shirt is a little crop and it looks kind of tiny i don't know why you girls thinking that she can fit in this but i'm working out so hopefully um it won't look super tight no i did try it already and it looked it looked really nice i feel like it's a really comfortable set you can dress it up dress it down so i'm not mad at this i really can't remember how much i paid for this uh it's been a while for this one i haven't worn it but um it was in the sale rack i do remember that so i probably paid like 20 bucks or 16.99 okay the last thing from marshall's is some zapatos and this zapatos I know might not be everybody's cup of tea. And I'm still kind of questioning my, my, my choice here. But I have a vision. I have an outfit in my mind. And I'm going to make it work. And I also feel that I can get a lot of uses of the shoes for work. So, ta-da! Who would have thought that the flats would come back in style? Like, I had so many from back in the day and I donated them and now i'm like should have kept all my flats but i found this ones i've been looking for some new red ones but i can't find any that um i like but when i came across this one so i'm like um this is a perfect color too it can be matched with so many different uh outfits the color is just like a nice cream color because they're not like straight white they might look very white but they're like a cream color uh, the material looks like it's nice. I like how it looks. It looks classy. Doesn't look cheap at all. And I just, I just like them. Again, I think you just have to wear the right outfit for them. And I have an outfit in my head. If it doesn't work, I might return them. But um, I paid twenty four ninety nine for this find at Marshalls. So those are my three Marshalls finds. What do you think? Which one did you like out of all those? I think if I had to choose one from those three, it's definitely the hat. Okay, moving along to La TJ Maxx. This one's starting off strong with another set, but not just any set. It's a workout set. I have not worn this one, and I think I got it at TJ Maxx, but now I'm thinking about it. I'm like, did I get it at TJ Maxx or Marshalls? But either way, it wasn't one of those stores, but I'm leaning more towards uh, TJ Maxx. So is this workout three-piece workout set? So let me zoom in so that you can see the pattern. Um, I don't know if it's catching the color, but it's like a beige brownish with uh, green splatters. It's kind of weird, but uh, I like it. So this is a little jacket. This is the top part. And this is... The top, of course, your girl would not wear it by itself because she's still not in that stage where she feels comfortable. <laughs> but these are the pants. So it's a great little three-piece set, and I think I paid $24.99. I can't remember, honestly. I haven't worn this one yet, um, but I'm excited to wear it because your girl has been going to the gym, and she's killing it out there. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> but I am going to the gym and I'm trying to be consistent and I didn't have any workout clothes um because it's been a while it's been a while I've done a lot of 5k's in the past and stuff but like working out and going consistently to the gym is something that wasn't happening but now that I am um I needed some sets or some clothes so I found this set and I think it's super cute moving on to the next one can you guess what it is another hat Tell me this color, first of all, if it's not the bomb.com. Look at this color. Uh, I'm well obsessed with the combination. Oh my god, look at all the combination of the colors. This nice yellow, like pale yellow with this bright blue is just like great. I love it and I love the price. It was only $7.99 and it says Bob's Garage. Can you see? I hope it's focusing. I don't know about like Bob's Garage, but um, I really like just the combination. And I already have an outfit in mind, so win-win. Next item is a little shirt or top. It's this top 
It looks tiny, right? It probably fits my knees. <laughs> but I plan on wearing it with um, like a denim shirt over it. So I really like it. It's super cute. Perfect for the summer. And it was on sale for $6. So I really like it because I feel that you can dress it up. You can dress it down. I could even wear it to work with a cardigan. So there's a lot of things I can do with this top. Next is another workout item. It's not a set, but it's a jumpsuit. And it's black. And it's a bell bottom. And it's from the brand Willow. So if I'm not mistaken, this brand is high quality. It's really good. You can feel it. It's very nice um, when I tried it on. I think this, honestly, I'm, I'm only 5'2". On a good day, I'm 5'3". <laughs> no, but I'm 5'2". And uh, so I'm tiny. And I honestly feel that this set, this, I mean, this jumpsuit would look amazing on someone that's tall. I'm, I'm just not that girl. But I'm still keeping it. I really like it I truly do it's just since I have a short torso it doesn't look as flattering as it would in someone with a longer torso but it's still cute I I love that it's black I love black it's um you could also wear it not just to the gym but you can wear it with like something on top of it as well I don't know I feel like you can get a lot of uses of it too it snatches you from the waist it has some padding here so that you don't have to wear like a sports bra underneath if you don't want to and again it's from the brand willow regular price it says it's 108 there 108 like regular price is 108 and i got it again for 24.99 and i really like it so i can't wait to wear this because i feel that not only is it like a little cute um workout uh outfit but also i feel like you can wear it for other things you can put like a little jacket over it um you can put a like an like i mentioned for the other shirt um, a denim shirt so i feel like you can wear more than just like for the gym so we'll see we'll see moving along to another set because you know i love myself sets and i think they're a good purchase and it's another like comfortable set you can dress it up and you can dress it down it looks like this I love the material I wish you guys can feel it it's like super soft it's just super soft that's what I loved about it also the color and then this is the top it's very simple but I love it because I think it's classy and I just love I love the look I feel like you can dress it up or dress it down depending on the shoes that you wear and the accessories that you wear and again it's super soft it reminds me of another set that I saw that I actually wanted and I'll try I can't remember the brand if I find it I'll include it here so that you can see if they look the same to me they look the same and when I picked it up from TJ Maxx I was like wait is this a set and I'm like no this is not the brand but I'm like, I'm getting it. It was $29.99. It's a little bit pricier, but I think it's because of the material. And it's a yoga licious scuba set. That's what it's called, I guess, because of the material. Stretchy. It is kind of see-through, I have to say that. Well, not kind of. It is very see-through. But, again, you can wear an undershirt under this and, like, some, some um, beige or uh, nude shorts under this but i love the material and i can't wait to wear this one i only have two more items left and i almost forgot to mention this one which is one of the items and it is a nice little necklace i'll zoom in in a little bit so that you can see it it's okay it's those very popular uh, trendy bubble letters um and i saw it at tj maxx i wasn't looking for this um and i saw it on the jewelry section they had like in their little shelves um where you have to ask for them to show you the stuff and i noticed that it was on sale so i'm like let me see how much it is and i believe i paid eight dollars for it or ten dollars for it when i purchased it i think i purchased this one uh late february i can't remember but i think it's super cute i wish the chain and this wasn't such a like um bright yellow but it's still cute. I love it and I do get compliments when I wear it. So 
that was a cute find for my last item it is a purse look at how unique this purse is look at the cuts of it i couldn't pass on on this if you follow me on tiktok you saw that i recently did a tiktok on all the purses that i found at tj maxx you should definitely go check out my tiktok but also go to tj maxx and check out their purses because they are on fire they're so nice i wish they had this one in black but i found it in this beautiful cream color i have no purses in cream so i said you can you can you can get it girl because you have nothing in this color i also love that it has gold and it's just very simple it's tiny it's great for like um a nice dress even you can dress it up dress it down there's so many ways you can style this purse i also like this that it has that magnet is it magnet yeah magnet right <laughs> and then the inside is tiny there's not a lot that you can fit in here that's for sure but um, you can fit your phone. I already used it once. I got compliments. Um, uh, my phone fit in there. My lip gloss. So yeah, my lip gloss. My phone. And then uh, my credit cards and stuff. And there we go. We are all good to go. I just think it's very unique and I definitely don't have nothing like this so that was a great find and I believe that is everything I hope that I'm not forgetting anything I put everything in the bag so I should be good because there's nothing else in either of the bags so <laughs> that is it for my TJ Maxx and Marshall haul tell me which one was your favorite uh, make sure that you like this video and that you are subscribed to my channel so that you're notified when my next video goes up. And as always, thank you so much for your support. I really appreciate it. And I'll see you till next time. Bye.